I have two questions which are related. The first one is uh, a number of countries still uh, allocate a very small portion of their budget to R&D. Uh, is there anything uh, ECA is doing uh, to you know, urge them to uh, allocate more to R&D? And number two, uh, some of our scientists are still uh, you know, not working together. And as a result of that, there's this issue of fragmented funding. How are you addressing this? Um, just putting 1% of GDP to R&D uh, is good, but what does it achieve? Um, so what we, are, what we want to do is to help African countries articulate better what, where they see their comparative advantages and where they see, uh, uh, or where they see their challenges and where they see R&D uh, um, investments meeting those challenges. And, and that is the, is, is, the, is the link that we need to ascertain. Um, I think the, 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 the idea of a 1% of GDP being bandied about is fine, but it, 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 when you unpack it, 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 it it's problematic. And, and that's the problem, because uh, you cannot expect... Uh, Togo to put 1% of, of its GDP on science and te technology, um, uh, what does that mean for the country in real terms? Uh, whereas if Nigeria decides to put 1% of its D GDP, that's colossal. However, what is Nigeria going to focus on? Because you have to focus. So in essence, what I'm saying is that the, the R&D has to be contingent upon the needs of the country. And that, for me, is the missing link and the missing gap. Scientists are not working together. Do you know, there are, there are several reasons for that. Currently, you will, you will find that 95% of the R&D that is funded in Africa and in countries are all externally driven. And therefore, um, it begs the question, why would scientists need to work together when they are all, in a way, vying for donor funds to do um, the, 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 the R&D, which never really reaches uh, the national, you know, the national, uh, uh, addresses the national issues. So um, I, I guess when the countries begin to organize better their science and technology and, what, and when they begin to articulate better what